Northeast Wisconsin couple who's always been passionate about helping others is launching a new effort to bring literacy to the poor. Stacey Ingebretson shows how you can help in tonight's NBC 26 Cares. Tyler Clark and his wife Rebecca are raising their two children in Alloway, but there's another group of kids thousands of miles away who they love like their own. This guy really, he just loved the, the missionaries. Tyler Clark enjoys reminiscing about his time as a Mormon missionary in Mexico. I lived with them for two years. These are some of the best loving people you'll ever meet. They're hardworking, but those living in the village of a Texcock are extremely poor. The nearest library is over an hour away. Um, that's by car, and most people don't have cars. So Tyler and his wife Rebecca created this GoFundMe page. The village is providing this building, and the Clarks will use their online donations to fill the new library. Whatever a book costs here, we can buy 16 down in Mexico. You know, that $3,000 or whatever we end up getting is, is huge. We believe in the power of education, especially reading. It can really change your life and give you opportunities to, um, for, the, for the future. And we want those kids to have that foundation. As word spreads about the project, a local company is now offering to donate computers to the library. The best opportunity these kids have is to learn how to do software development, how to do coding, because it's something they can do from their village. Um, and not have to come to the United States. Tyler and Rebecca say they're humbled by the outpouring of support. We've, we've been amazed. Ha most of our donations are people we don't even know, <laughs> which is awesome. And they're anxious to begin fulfilling their dream. When we all work together, we can do great things. Of improving the lives of children. If their online campaign raises enough money, the Clarks also hope to build a high school in the village. Right now, the kids meet on the roof of the mayor's office, and a couple of students have fallen off, breaking their bones. Stacy Engebretson, NBC 26. Now, if you'd like to learn more about the Clarks Library Project, just go to NBC26.com, click on the story for a link to their GoFundMe page.